السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسولنا محمد سيد الأولين وآخرين مدد رسول الله مدد سادات أصحاب رسول الله مدد أنا شيخ مدد السماء ولا شاء الله فعزاء سيد الشيخ محمد ناظر الرحمن مدد طريقتنا الصحبة والخير في الجميع مبارك رمضان أيضا أيضا فجاء بيجان بارك في نفسهم زمان ضد Hadiseler olmuş, mühim hadiseler olmuş. Birincisi de, yani onlardan birisi bu günlere rastlıyor. Ramazan ortalarına doğru Bedir Savaşı, mübarek savaş. Peygamber Efendimiz Allah'ın takdiriyle bunu Gaza, büyük Bedir gazası derler buna. Peygamber Efendimiz iştirak edip Allah'ın yardımıyla küffarlara ağır bir yenilgi verdi. Bütün o Kureyş'in müşrikleri, en büyükleri Orada öldürüldü. Peygamber Efendimiz'e seneler de işkence yapıp insanları dinden men eden insanlar o gün hepsi 70 tane onlardan öldürüldü orada. Öldürülüp kör kuyuya atıldı. Bu Allah'ın e, lütfudur. Allah'ın yardımı yardım olduktan sonra bütün dünya onlar çokluktu. Yani Müslümanların üç katı kadar vardı. Silah olarak on katı daha fazlaydı yani. Ama bütün dünya bile karşılarına gelseydi Allah Azze ve Celle yardımı olduktan sonra bir şey olmaz. Bu bütün Müslümanlara kıyamete kadar güzel bir hatıradır. Allah'ın yardımını istemeleri için. Şimdi Ta Osmanlı'da baştan beri tabi de en son Osmanlı'dan sonra daha beter İslam'a saldırı başladı. İslam'a saldırı yapıyorlar, bitirsinler diye bitiremezler. Her türlü kafirin binlerce çeşidi var. Kafir hiçbir zaman Müslümanı kabul etmez, onu bitirmek ister. Ama Allah Azze ve Celle onlara fırsat vermiyor. Müslümanlara ikaz için onları saldırtırıyor yani. Müslümanlar doğru yolu bırakınca Allah bu kefereyi üstlerine musallat ediyor. Ta ki tövbe edip Allah'tan yardım istesinler diye. Peygamber Efendimiz de Bedir kazasına Allah'ın hikmeti yani gaza için çıkmadılar. Bedir, şey, Kureyş'in kafilesi vardı. Mekke'deki Kureyşlerin yolunu kestiler diye oraya çıktı. Onlar da duyunca saldırıya geçti. Mekke'den bin kişi geldi. Peygamber Efendimiz'in maksat 
Böyle bu, onların hepsinin savaş değil ama Allah'ın iradesidir bu. Allah öyle irade etti. Peygamber Efendimiz de ümmete misal örnek olsun diye orada Allah'tan yardım dileyip geri çekilmeden Allah yolunda cihad etti. Allah da yardım edip güzel bir e, zafer kazandıydı. Ha, bu Allah'la beraber olan insanlar daima e, zafer kazandılar Allah'ın izniyle. Şimdi bu dünyada çeşit çeşit zulüm oluyor. Zulümler İslam'a, Müslümanlara oluyor. Tabi Müslümanları da kullanıp birbirlerine kırdırıyorlar. Öyle olunca işte Allah Azze ve Celle de başkasını musallat ediyor ki akılları başlarına gelsin. Zaten ahir zaman oldu. Artık Mehdi Aleyhisselam'ın çıkması da daha yaklaştı. Bütün dünyaya İslam'ı yayacak Allah'ın izniyle. Şimdi her tarafta İslam'a hakaret edip zannediyorlar ki biz galip geldik. Yok. Az bir şey olsalar bile gene Allah Azze ve Celle'nin yardımıyla İslam galip gelecek. Tabi ya bu olan hadiselere dua edip yardım el ancak olur. Çünkü öyle bir vakıtta yaşıyoruz ki iyilik yapayım dersen yahut bir iyilik yapacağım zannedersin Müslümanlığa yardım edeceksin dersen o tam tersi oluyor. Bunu hileyle hurdayla millete milleti kandırıyorlar. Milleti iyilik yapayım derken daha kötü oluyor. Şimdiki zaman bekleme zamanıdır. Sakin olun. E bir şey duyuyorlar millet, çıkıyorlar. Tabi karşı taraf sizin onu yapmanız için yapmış oluyor. Sen de zannediyorsun ben iyilik yapıyorum. Müslüman kardeşimi kayırıyorum. Halbuki seni, seni de daha beter edecekler. Bu dediğimiz gibi konuşmamak daha iyi Allah'a dua etmek lazım. Yollara, sokaklara çıkıp şuna buna bağırmaya hiç gerek yok. Çünkü onun hiçbir faydası yok. Zararından başka bir şey yok. Orada boş boşuna bağırırsın. Oradaki insanlara, o zulüm gören insanlara daha fazla zulüm yaparlar. Sen burada bağırdıkça onlar orada daha fazla zulüm ederler. Çünkü şimdi zalimlerin zamanıdır. Biz bekleyeceğiz, Allah'a dua edeceğiz ki onların zamanı bitsin. Zulüm yerine adalet gelsin. Mehdi Aleyhisselam inşallah. Yakın olsun inşallah. <coughs> Today elhamdülillah we are in 17 of Ramadan. Normally it is uh, in Ramadan many thing happen in time of Prophet sallallahu aleyhi ve sellem and it is day of Badr. Badr meaning 
first war against Quraysh, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he was uh, Allah not giving him order for fighting or war until coming to Medina and then Medina even later Allah they give permission to fight because no any uh, thing else can done to defend themselves they must fight and Prophet Sallallahu was intending to take this uh, uh, there was caravan coming from Damascus to Mecca to cut this to make embargo for Quraysh to not uh, make trouble for them they went to reach this caravan but in caravan there was Abu Sufyan he is clever he ran away from other way and he sent for Quraysh before they, they was sending to come to help us after this Quraysh was very angry and they prepared thousand army people with everything very strong army and they intend to come but Abu Sufyan said to them no need we have we are safe now <coughs> but they was proud he said no we must go there and we must show ourselves and we three days we stay in Badr and make uh, drink alcohol, eat uh, meat, and the dancing, singing. If anything happen, we attack them. If no, we can go back. Because normally Arab there, sometimes they're doing this, not fighting, only coming, showing, and going back. And Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he not intention to make war with them, but even when they are coming to Badr, there wasn't no Quraysh they coming there. But when they uh, take this news, Prophet Sallallahu asked Sahaba, what you saying? We are not coming here for fighting these people. We can go back and later we, we can fight. And this, uh, the Sahaba saying, no, we, we are with you, what you like, what you order, we are following your order. <coughs> we are not like people of Musa, Ben Israel, who said to Musa, go, you and your Lord, fight these people, and after we can come and go to this city, Ariha. We are from front of you, from behind of you, from everything. We are with you. We are not going back. Uh, what you order, we can do. Even you say, go to this sea, we can go without looking behind us. And Prophet Sallallahu was happy and he prepared for fighting these people. And many miracles Allah make for them. And they was, Alhamdulillah, uh, they have victory. Because even before war, there was uh, wise uh, people from Mushrik people, they said, we we think we must go back. This is not good for us. 
and who say this he was very strong one, when he, very brave one, and he said, even you said, I am, uh, I am afraid, you can say, I am afraid, but we must go back. But Abu Jahl, he said, what are you saying this? He was shouting on him and say, saying, we will not go back, we will fight with this, because they are not so much, and we come until here, so we cannot go back. They will say for us, we are afraid. And this is hikmah from wisdom from Allah to punish these people. In this battle, there were 70 of them killed. The most uh, uh, bad one, <coughs> there was whole time uh, making people to not listen to Prophet Sallallahu They was harming Prophet Sallallahu They was uh, laughing for Prophet Sallallahu When he is speaking, they making uh, like joke and uh, every uh, bad thing they was doing, the 70 people, they was killed in this battle. And this, uh, for this wisdom, they won't go back. Especially this Abu Jahl, the worst one he was. And the, he was killed there. After this, uh, Prophet Sallallahu uh, was uh, saying for them when they throw them in well this that body coming and to say them do you see what I was promised you were now seeing because and the Sahaba asking they hearing yes they said he, when somebody died he hear also and they hear, and they know, but there is no any chance for them to uh, come back. Uh, whole time, the Prophet Sallallahu was warning them, uh, saying them in a good way, in good, uh, nice talking, what they was doing, harming him, and they was uh, not respecting, not. Uh, taking any care of this warning. And it, uh, at the end, they was finished. And now, in this time also, whole people, whole world coming against Islam. They want to finish Islam. And they have not ten trick, million, billions of tricks there to finish this, but they will not finish. Because as Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam say, Allah, he was with him, and there was only one third of the army of Mushrik, and no weapon, no horse, no anything, very few, and there was warning on this mushrik because Allah with them Allah want them to win and this is re Islam Allah religion for human being and for now also all this people they make a trick they said this is Muslim they killing Muslim but it's not Muslim they are also from their trick and they want everywhere they are oppressing but it will be, inshallah, at the end, whole world, inshallah, it will be Muslim, Islam spreading, uh, but not like this by one by one, when Mahdi alayhi salam coming, whole world it will be Muslim, and the, who are not accepting, they will go uh, for, uh, from this world. <coughs> Allah help us and this is time of
to be quiet, no need to be <coughs> shout going for demonstration. Something happened from in one country of their people. Quickly, they are shouting, screaming, uh, making uh, thing. What the uh, shaitan teach them to show them as they are not good people. Muslim, he must be respected one and ask from Allah to help them and Allah, he will help. Inshallah. No need to do what these people, they are especially teaching people to do this, to show them as it is not good. And when you say this, the people, they are not happy. You are happy or not happy, we must say what uh, truth, what you must done, what you must not done. The Prophet was uh, uh, until coming to Medina, not fighting these people. So you might, if you don't have power, you don't have anything, don't do, and you must do under your uh, uh, guidance, not with uh, some people going fighting, no, you cannot do this. You are under, under uh, country, and uh, or like Mahdi alayhi salam, you must wait. No need to hurry, because if you hurry, you will be destroy yourself and other people also. Allah save us from Amen. trick of this uh, shaitan and his follower. Amen.